If that was an attempt to bring me down, I graded an F. <laughs> Looks like you were internally injured by legend. I hope that's your excuse for being so weak. I hate to repeat myself, but you can't just beat me with your reputation. Huh? Where'd he go? You aren't bad either. Yeah. You may be an excellent fighter, but you're not very smart. You don't belong here, Shin. Come on, boy. Beg for forgiveness. What is it that every school I've been to has a teacher like you? I'll never know. I'll have to admit, it wasn't easy. Guess I took more damage from Guy than I thought. Hold on, Miss Jinx. Get him! I'll take it from here, boss. Get this chick somewhere safe. Quickly! I owe you one now. Alright, you fools. It's time for me to show you what happens when you mess with the school captain. Shut your... <gasps> I doubt this is how it really happened, but rumor has it that Legend lost in a match with Guy. Even with Legend gone, some of his followers are doing what they can to bring Guy down. But whatever happens, in the end, it's Guy's victory. What the hell is going on here? <laughs> yeah! Why is Guy so obsessed with closing the school down? Well, for starters, Guy understands the school system. If our school gets closed down, most likely we'll all be transferred to different schools that make the cut. For a lot of students, this is actually a better alternative. But knowing Guy, moving to a better school environment is not part of his intention. So what does Guy really want? I guess you can say that Guy wants to challenge the system. After he's transferred to a new school, he'll start his little game all over again. Transfers. I think his name's Andre. <laughs> so he wants to try out for the team, eh? Well, we don't want you here! What? Impossible! I might as well the top 10 pitchers in the nation! This guy is really something. Nice hit. 
Well, let's see if you can hit one of my pitches. <laughs> Not bad. Welcome to the team. Good. Then I'll see you around. What are you saying, Finric? We don't want him on the team! He's ambidextrous, just like I am. Makes me wonder, what would have happened if the bat didn't break? There. Third kick? This guy's all over the place. I've had enough of these lame tricks of yours! You. I remember your name. Ralph Wallet Jr. You were obviously on the losing end. Oh? Is that how it went? Feel free to argue differently if you care. Well, since you put it that way. So that's Legend from 1368. I've heard so many stories about this guy. I wonder if they're all true. The tables have sure turned, haven't they? <laughs> Enjoy the moment while it lasts, Otoman. Then why is that, Shin? Cause you won't remember anything after this. What the? I shouldn't try and mess with you. That's good advice. Unfortunately, I'd rather face you than answer to Demir. You should try showing a little more determination. Let me get one thing straight. I don't look out for anyone else but myself. There is no need to worry, Sylvia. Your records will be cleared of any evidence that may harm your chances of entering the university of your choice. Thank you, Mr. Demir. This will also apply to any questionable activities you may be involved in in the future. The ones that will take place under my orders. Oh, I've been around to Mir, and so have you. I've gathered records detailing a lot of corrupt activity in my past schools, and believe me, your name comes up more than a few times. 
Then you should know that I'm not the only one involved in such things. Why should I be the one who takes all the blame? Don't worry, you're not the only one who's taking the fall. And with all the recent media coverage, you've turned yourself into an icon for the education system. Destroying that image turns everything upside down. In other words, when you need a catalyst big enough to turn the tide, you just happen to be there. Where do you think you're going? Ah! Uh!